Hi friends, I'm back. Um, I've been on a girls trip, a girls weekend in Ojai, and I thought, why don't we do a little makeup video? I haven't done one in so long. So I know I've been doing a lot of house videos in my new house I'm building, so go back and watch those. But let's just do this really quick. I picked some things that you probably already have, um, and not, we'll just start with my eyebrows. The only thing I have on my face right now is this Born to Glow foundation from NYX, and I don't know what shade it's in, medium olive, which is a little dark, but it's been summer, so anyways, so I'm gonna start with my eyebrows, and I've got this Too Faced Brow Envy little kit, and it comes um, with these colors here, and I'm gonna do the darker. I've been doing my eyebrows a little darker. I think it's been good. It's been like, it makes, I feel like if you just do your eyebrows, it makes you look so much younger, I don't know why, it, I mean, it's just as we get older, our eyebrows just kind of fade away. And so I've been doing them a little darker and I kind of like it. So I'm just gonna fill them in a little bit. And then all I do after I fill them in is just take the br brush applicator um, spoolie that it comes with and just kind of work it out like that and we'll rub it in. And look at that, what a different, okay, hi. What a difference that makes just to fill in your eyebrows. Okay, and if they're a little wonkier, we need to fill them in later. Um, or sometimes I'll take that lighter color and just fill them in a little bit more with the lighter color. And you just kind of, until they get them, you get them just about where you want them. And again, just take your spoolie. Okay, there's the eyebrows, done. How easy was that? Then I'm gonna take my eyelash curler. This one is the Tweezer Man. And I always, always, always curl my eyelashes. Love that. And just probably about eight seconds each side. Okay, then I have this Tartlet in Bloom and I think my daughter Nicole got this for me. So you probably have a Tartlet palette. Um, it's got all these, you know, colors. And I'm gonna start at the bottom and it's Rebel, this color right here, Rebel. And I'm just gonna take um, like a little round fluffy brush and I'm just gonna go right in my crease, right like this, real easy. And on the lid, I'm gonna go on the crease and the lid, just like that, okay? So go with the crease and the lid. And here's the deal, this is so pigmented. And if you get too much or you feel like it's too dark, and I do a little underneath the eye too, and we're gonna clean it all up later. Um, but if you get too much, you can always put, I always put like a little shimmer underneath or on top of it and it just lightens it up. So it's better to go dark because um, you can always lighten it up. Okay, yeah, look at that. And you always go a little higher into the crease again. It's anti-aging and yeah, like that. How easy is that? Okay, then I'm going to go in with the lighter color. So, um the one right next to it on the bottom here. That's called Sweetheart. And I'm just gonna go up here with it. And then the one right next to it, right here, is the shimmer. And then I go over it with that. And that's right under your brow. How great is that? Yep, that's it. And in the crease, okay? Like that in the crease. How easy is that? Okay, then I'm going to take my this, I haven't used this in so long. This is the Divinisils, the little um, coat that you put on before. I'm not gonna let that dry while I'm doing the rest of my makeup. Cause I don't wanna, you don't wanna put your mascara on that. So that's just kind of a little booster. It's called Cells Booster, boosts the lashes. Okay, then next thing I'm gonna do is some eyeliner. And I just love a black eyeliner. This is the Lancome, um, let's see. Black Ebony 602, okay, Le Crayon Cole. And I always like to do a black eyeliner or a dark eyeliner, just right above the lash line there. And I kind of flick it out at the end, like that, like a little cat eye flick. And it's really easy to do, just like that, okay? Yeah, just like that, perfect. Then I do a little right the lash line little black right at the lash line like that. Perfect. Oh, 
simple. And by the way, I'm just gonna talk a little bit. I was using Lumify and I was like, Lumify is amazing. It makes your eyes so bright. Brightest, whitest eyes ever. Then I started noticing after like a month that, um, yeah, uh, my eyes started getting like really red. I'm like, it's the darn Lumify. So I stopped using Lumify and my eyes have not been crazy red. So I'm gonna retract my recommendation on Lumify. Now, if you have an event to go to, I would use it in a once in a blue moon. But yeah, so just word of caution about Lumify. Been meaning to tell you that. Okay, so I'm putting on my Hula bronzer and yep, just right under there. And then I'll do it a little bit on my forehead and a little on the jawline like that. And then pull it down on the jawline like that. Yep, and then just pull it right down like that. Okay, that's your bronzer. Then um, I'm gonna do a little highlight. And this highlight is the Oprah uh, Rodeo Drive. I love a little highlighter. So again, just right on that cheekbone like this. And of course I love a little shimmer, little JLo glow. Okay, and has anyone used JLo's new glow products? I saw it at Sephora, but I haven't tried it yet. So let me know in the comments below. Okay, and don't forget to subscribe. Who is watching and not subscribing? Rude. Okay, then, <laughs> moving on. Then I'm going to do, um, oh, I have this, I found my spare minerals, and it's in um, Honesty is the color. I found this the other day, and I'm like, oh, I love this. So I'm gonna put a little lipstick on and then I'll go over it with a shimmer. But okay, what a difference a little lipstick makes, love that. All right, then, now that my mascara has, or the, the booster has dried, I'm gonna finish with my mascara. So again, this is the Lancome. This is an OG and my daughter Emily swears by this. I sometimes like a little bolder, um, this goes on, it's like more of a day, I would say a day, but look at the difference in my eyes actually right now. Can you see that? Yeah. Mascara, honestly, is my favorite thing. I could not go without mascara. That's why people are always getting their lashes done because they can just walk out the house. Okay, right? Look at that. Ugh, I love mascara. Okay, so there's the mascara and then we're gonna do a little bit of concealer under the eyes here to get rid of the dark circles and to um, get rid of any fallout from the eyeshadow that's fallen down. Okay, so I'm using, this is an OG Makeup Forever HD. And what is the color? I'll put it down below. And all you do is take a little amount and I just put it right there. Now, if you have some red spots, I, I like to clean up a little there yeah, too. Under the nose, sometimes I don't know where it's about there. Okay, then I'm gonna take my kitty cat paw brush that I love so much, and just clean up and brighten all under the eyes. And then I kind of gives you a little lifting too because you kind of go like right under there, and I love that. Okay, and and then you just blend it right there. And sometimes, well, I've already put my shimmer on, but sometimes my chin gets a little red. So if I haven't put my shimmer on already, I'll put on my, the um, bottom of my chin. Okay, then I'm gonna end with this NYX uh, banana powder. And if you don't know about this banana powder, this is like what you put under your eyes to set it. And again, you just tap it right under there and it sets your concealer. And then you don't get like wrinkles or you know what I mean? Where it cake, cakes and stuff. Okay. Like that. Then we're going to end with a little gloss over the lips. And this is Joie. It's like a little rose glitter on the lips. Oh my gosh. And it tastes like vanilla. Yeah. Joie. And there you go, guys. A little makeup video. I love makeup. I love the transformative power of makeup. It makes you look younger. It just makes me feel good to leave the house and have a little makeup. So there you go. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next week. Bye.